like, that's for sure. People can like what they like. I'm not gonna, you know, hate on them. I'm just gonna be up front. Obviously, if you like Smash Ultimate, you gotta like Cheese. A little bit. A little bit. I'm like a, like Cheddar. I kind of like Cheddar. He's a cool player. So I guess I like Cheese. Fair enough. Dang, ASN putting on that damage though. Oh. Oh. Yeah, mess up Popo. He doesn't need to play the game. <laughs> so earlier in uh, in sets, ASN had his Popo uh, footstool the uh, the other guy to convert into a combo. Mm. And it was not in it, like the AI just did that. He didn't do the input, it just happened. So, I, think, uh, I think I'd really like ICs if I just watched the game. Honestly, ASN plays him. He doesn't play like the zero to death. He does like zero to eighty sometimes, like occasionally. Uh, but it's usually pretty neutral. I haven't played against him. I beg to differ. Okay, then you got caught by some schmicks, buddy. That's caught all I gotta by, say. Caught by some schmicks. Oh my god. He ripped it all on that F smash. Not gonna convert this. So Eagle getting that clean back here. So Eagle doing a good job splitting him up. This last game, or not last game, last stock. We are zoning. Jeez. We are walling and we are zoning. How does ASM break through? Side B is his answer so far. The spot dodge? Yeah, what do you think about that? Spot S smash, spot dodge, S smash. Are you a fan? I'll let you take a wild guess. I mean, you could do it too. Yes, I can do it too. And I feel like it's really good for you. You know what I can't do? What? Punish somebody for landing a grab on me. That is true. I cannot do that. To me, that breaks all the rules look, of the game. Look, look, look. To me. But then you know what? Everybody you has know, different rules. Look, Waifu Season got many grabs off, and he just uses the grab armor. It is what it is. So you just got to throw him immediately. It's not that deep. ASN's a good player, obviously. He's kind of getting smoked right now, though. Yeah, you know. Back throw, is that going to take it? Not yet. It's game one. We got a long set. Is he just dead? I don't even sweat it anymore. Yeah, wait it up, man. He's walling him out very well, though. A single Joe is no stranger to this matchup. I don't think Waifu Seasons typically play in ASN. That seems like a matchup that doesn't happen super often. So they were kind of like doing it on the fly. Yep. But single Joe, no stranger. Oh, yeah, he's, he's destroying him. Oh, oh, big damage. He screwed that. Wow. The grab armor, huge. I'm telling you, that's all you gotta do. It's all you gotta do. Don't you love to hear that? I mean, like, just don't get hit. Oh. Uh, it's a simple game plan, really. What? That's a conversion. You ought to run for office. Dang. So you don't just, like, get out of here. Yeah, you smoked it. That was crazy. It's early, it's early set, though. Did you see the winner's semis? Uh, ZD versus Seagull? Nah, I didn't. Seagull was playing Ra Ra. You know who that is? Ra Ra. Mithra, Pyra. Oh. Mm. Now you know. Um, but yeah, he was playing them against ZD's pit. I don't know how that occurred. And, pit, and he took a game with the pit, too. It's like his third best character, I think. Who's the second? Oh, yeah, I guess he got a fox. I don't know, something like that. He win a lot, you know. He just do stuff like that. He didn't play the fox, though. Not that set. Big damage. Big damage. We'll see if ASN uh, can adapt. Uh, that is not barely with him. I don't even know if that's what he wanted. I feel like he probably wanted to dash tech. Dash tech splits the timers up really well. Pairing does not matter. Dang, that was Popo. The AI did that. Or I guess maybe uh, ASN did on an input. I do say, you're not wrong. You do have to play like a totally different game against these two. It's just not the same. Yeah, I mean, it's okay, though, because they're the only one of 30 that you have to do that for, so. 30? Yeah. I'm not sure I know where that number came from. But regardless. Seagull currently down. I guess I'm going to get killed by that up smash, though. It only killed him. It didn't kill Popo. That was crazy. Yeah, I actually lost track. I thought he was still alive. Yeah, it's tricky. He plays a skin where they look like the same. That's cool. It's like Game of Watch doing the white skin, so you can't see the tangibility. Oh, that's even cooler. 
You gotta love them. Or just, you know, do what you do and don't take the game too serious. Well, I failed at that today. Ah, classic yeah. maneuver. Yeah. It was a big mistake by me. It happens. Hey, I'm looking for an air dodge in. Seagull so not gonna give it. Teleport pass. You just gotta respect the respect the cheese. Honestly, I feel like the big thing is ASM is just like, if I have less space, I win. Like, I just rush you down. Uh, yeah. Yeah, there it is. I mean, that's that was nice. just a spot that was just for a second. I mean, like, yeah, it's good, but like, the only reason why that, uh, half the time, Seagull just be running away on PS2 is you got the space to do it, right? Here, he doesn't. Can't wall him out as effectively. It's hard. Yep. ASM has adapted. I felt it in my bones. He would. Okay. Well, I'm not going to get the second up there, though. But the Nair to cover. You see that trait? He covers roll with that, too. Isn't that crazy? It's a good move. Good setups. This character is all setups. You just got to learn the setups. Just got to learn the setups. It's, everything is just just gotta. There's like 90 just gotta's. Can't get grabbed, just don't get grabbed. Duh. Just got to not get hit. Just gotta, End of the day. Just got to not get grabbed. Look, Seagull just, just hits that to jump. heart. The, the don't get hit, he tries. Just got to not plug in your controller. There's so many just gotchas when it comes to I mean, time. that is one of them. I can't. I can't lie. What you think? What you think the counter pick is? You mean stage? Yeah. I would take him to like. I don't know. I probably just take him back to PS2. He Big probably stage. banned that. I assume. I, I mean, there's also DSR Hollow makes sense. Bigger stage. Yeah. Center plat's the same as that Smashville, but they both don't get anything crazy off that plat. Yeah, he wasn't sure. This he, is a really simple game plan. I gotta give it up here though. ASM has just consistently found ways to get in with side B. We're gonna talk about good moves. It's not even like crazy good like that. It's just once You're you crazy. do hit it. You're just actually insane. That's Ooh. one of the one of the best moves in the game. No sir. Flat out. You just shield it. <laughs> 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 no, you can't always shield you it. You can fade it back, this. obviously, but um, it's definitely not Just like, it's like pretty scripted and it comes out for, it takes a while to come out. So if you don't get hit by it outright or and like on shield even, then like you can usually punish it. It's nothing crazier than like a wolf nair. Oh, it's much crazier. Is it? Oh yeah. I guess it does lead into one. But a palu nair though, same damage, low key. Doesn't lead to kills though. Good drift back from Seagull there. Not gonna get a clip. Uh, you know, there. I hope ASM is. I really do. Do you? Yeah, yeah. Why not? Could have fooled me. It doesn't even matter. No, he got him. He knew it was up. <laughs> Big damage. You just know the chat's rooting for ASN. ASN doesn't get here all that often. Yeah, no, that's why they're rooting. It's far for more it. interesting. Also, like, winner, like, grand finals, Ice Climbers, he gets six games to work with minimum. Mm -hmm. Oh, that was a great up smash. Delayed, super long. Late it just kills. The flicker and shield. We're Japanese out in this house. Honestly, hats off to Seagull here, though. He's done a great job of separating the climbers whenever he gets the opportunity. And it's causing ASN to either have to choose to let one of his, like, crucial pieces of his game plan go and that he can't do these things, or to, like, put himself in disadvantage. Cheeky up there to try and clip him that ledge. Not going to give it, though. That's a good punish on the side B. Just explosive flame it. If it had landed. Yeah. I think there's a lot of things Pelu can do that makes this matchup. This matchup seems pretty bad, pretty tough at least. Yeah, I'll agree with that. But yeah, I gotta admit, Ice Climber's neutral, not super deep. Seagull Joe, I mean, he's just super down to play that game. He's like, okay, you want to look for these options? Listen, All right, I'll just play I'm shocked he didn't get punished. Here. I'm telling you, the grab armor. Well, like, that's the only one I'm actually telling you about. Like, he could have just straight up died.
That helps too. Oh, he oh, we got him. <laughs> I know it. He killed Nana, or he killed Popo because of the side B. That's crazy. Popo just sucks at holding the shield. Oh, the tomahawk. That was beautiful. That was good. Reading the jump there, the uh, ASM jump back. Still in the corner, though. Nope. Is that never going to do it? Yes, he is. All right. 2-1 Secret That Joe. bigger stage. He, and you know what? He uses it such to his advantage. He just like dashes away on the side beast and it's like, alright, what do you do? The way doing? he uses teleport is so huge in this matchup. He just gets past him for yeah. free a lot of the time off ledge. He was using it really well against... Um, Ices have to back you into the corner. Who's he playing? He was like in Winner's Quarters. Who did he play in Winner's Quarters? I don't remember. ASM? No, no, no. Secret Joe played somebody in Winner's Quarters. He needed a lot of that uh, teleport pass to get back to stage. I mean, it was just super effective. You got a lot of mileage out of that. Take a turn at 11. Sheesh. Three, two, one, go! Jeez. Oh, it was Squid. Oh, God. Okay. Dang, Nair beat side B outright? Yeah. For real? Ha, <laughs> that was cheeky. So I'd be in run up and go to a grab, and then you got a desync too. Ice Climbers is not a character that you need to win neutral more with. It's a character you just need to win neutral once with. That is definitely a thing. Yep. High risk, high reward, right? Or well, low risk, high reward sometimes, but. I just like that they kept them consistent throughout the series, right? Everybody hates them in every game? Yeah. I don't know. I feel like in Brawl they were fine because Meta Knight's the villain. Uh. In Brawl, they were not fine, but people cared a little less just because uh, oh, Meta Knight was recovery in there. right there. But yeah, no. They were like second best in the game. Or, I wasn't or, really or second. Least, I know they were up there. at least close to I it. I know they were up there. Close to second best. Top five at least. He's walling them out. They really went back to Hollow. I guess yeah, I don't know why he went back to Hollow. I'm surprised. I feel like Small Battlefield would have been a better pick. But I guess he gets the easy yeah. platform cancels with like warp, but... Even still, the smaller stage seemed to do him more good than the platform. That's so crazy. That was so much damage. The way he uses his projectiles and then uh, gets aggressive to separate them. You know who was really good at Brawl? I don't know. Seagull Joe. Oh. Uh, Just a thought. Just a thought. Knows the character pretty well. I mean, they haven't changed a whole lot since Brawl. I think they changed a good bit since Melee, but... got him separated no in terms of well, I should say that they changed a lot of advantage but in disadvantage these characters same it's everybody's favorite offspring song yeah this is looking real clinical right now just separates the climbers kills one eventually doesn't matter which one yeah if it's the one that's the player cool next stock if not all right cool now it's so nano versus me who cares the way he's been getting, pressuring him and getting away with it is crazy. Yes, yeah, so, I mean, Palutena's got some of the safest options in the game, so long as you're good at spacing. Yep. And he has no slouch on the spacing. I watched Seagull Joe just play fundies all day. He's just outplayed him. Oh, good catch. This was honestly unlucky for ASN. I think he would have had a better shot at ZD. I agree. He's the spacey killer from what I've been told. Oh, well, yeah, spacey's, uh, they don't do well in this one, in my opinion. It's a little tougher, for sure. Holy Is that a two frame? Smoke. He was like way below the ledge. But yeah, Yikes. no. Seagull Joe just way absolutely clinical in that matchup. He's like, all right, you're off stage. You got no recovery mix. Not really. So I'm just going to charge an up smash, and then I'm going to rip it. And then whenever it hits, you die. He played it well. Play you got to respect it. Play it up. You know, I have a lot of respect for ASN. Because he lost? No, no, because he's... He's a player who tries to win very hard. You know, he does try to win. He spends a lot of time in the lab. Does he? Oh, come on! You gotta I mean, spend like, a lot of time in the lab to you? play ICs. I feel oh, like yeah. once you know it, it's like you you know it. You don't need to like go back in the lab unless you're trying to learn. You something You gotta else. spend a lot of time in the lab to get there. That's sure. fair. I'll give it up. So yeah, and at even least at still, some point in time. Even still, you know, I may not like playing against ICs. I may not want to play the game when I play against ICs. I may think they're even a poorly designed character, but that's not up for me to decide. You can argue the same for a lot of characters in this game. I think you just